The golden tree frog of Malaysia is a treetop acrobat. Usually it hops just a few meters. But if it meets a golden tree snake, it happily makes a leap into the unknown. As it plummets, spread limbs slow its descent and its webbed feet double up as a parachute. The javan flying frog goes one better. Its webbed feet have evolved into miniature wings. Instead of parachuting, it paraglides at an angle. But it's the Wallace frog that achieves aeronautical perfection. Its huge webbed feet become aerofoils that slow and control its descent. It glides as far forward as the distance it falls. As well as winged feet, its whole body is aerodynamically shaped. This is classic evolution. One feature progressively improved until perfection is achieved. Lizards lack webbed feet, so they expand other body features to get their wings. The flying gecko's impressive glide angle is due to wing-like fringes on its body. Every available edge has an aerodynamic extension. But it's the Draco lizard whose design really flies. A huge aerofoil turns the Draco into a living frisbee, while its tail steers like a rudder. Foldable ribs act as support struts to create the perfect wing. The golden tree snake uses other aeronautical tricks for its leap of faith. It loops its body for the ultimate takeoff and projects forward to gain a head start. It then flattens into a ribbon and swims through the air using S-shaped waves of its body. The star of this jungle air show is the owner of the most extravagant wings. From 80 meters up, the Wallace frog glides 80 meters forward. The gecko soars 100 meters. But nothing beats the flying frisbee. The Draco reaches a full 200 meters. Even a flying snake makes 150, complete with a controlled landing. 